honey. I feel like it's been forever. How have you been? Yeah. That's good to hear. Okay. How long has it been? Like two months? Three months? Yeah. I should have guessed by how long your hair got. It looks really nice. Yeah. And your beard. Jeez, you can grow such an even beard. That looks amazing. You look really handsome. Okay. So, uh, what are we thinking you want to do today? Okay. Do you mind if I take a look? All right, let me just come in here. Yeah. Okay. Well, your hair definitely looks really healthy. I know we always go, uh, little longer on the top and shorter on the sides. Okay. Well, we could do a, a little play with that length and keep it kind of long on the top. Longer than usual. You could use some texture in it. Okay. No, I think it would look really, really nice. Um, and then you thinking you want to keep the beard? Not sure. You know, I think you should keep it. Yeah, I think it just looks really nice. It accentuates your features. You look so handsome. So, um, what we can do is sort of clean it up a little bit. I would keep it a little bit longer down here and kind of trim up some of the fullness. Kind of show that nice shape of your face. You have great cheekbones. Okay. Yeah, so we'll keep it. I'll clean it up. Um, we will do a scissor cut up top and trimmers on the clippers on the sides um, and I'm gonna come in with a straight razor under your uh, jaw, neck and we'll clean all that up and clean up around your edges of your beard, okay? Yeah, you're gonna look awesome. So, let me just go ahead and get this gown on you, okay? All caped up. We'll make sure that uh, you don't get hair all over you. <laughs> you have plans tonight? Oh, very nice. Yeah, that sounds like fun. Yeah. Yeah, I haven't been there in a while, but I really like it. Um, I really like their chicken cordon bleu. It's good. They have a good wine list, too. Okay, so let me just grab my clippers. All right. So I'm going to come in, I'm going to start um, on your beard, and we're just going to get that nice and trimmed up, and then I'm going to come right up and do your sides and back, okay? Alright. Just get in here. Okay, here we go. So beard looks good. I'm just going to come and do um, your sides now. I'm going to leave the top alone. We're keeping that length, but I'm going to do the sides and the back, okay? was really quick. 
Your texture of hair is perfect for the clippers. It just goes through so fast. Okay, so that looks amazing. Just come in here and make sure that I like the length of this beard, okay? Okay. Yeah, I love that. Okay, very, very nice. Now I'm going to come in and um, I'm going to put some shaving cream all around your beard. We're not touching your beard with the straight razor, but I am going to come under and around the cheekbones, okay? All right. We've done straight razor with you before, right? Okay. Yeah. Now, I know some men are a little nervous about it, but I'm very good at it. Trust me. Okay. Okay, just a little bit of that. I got this new uh, line smell. Do you like that? Yeah. I think it smells really good. Okay. Okay. Just gonna get this on here. So how's your mom doing? Yeah. Oh, that's good. She's still teaching over at the high school. She was the best teacher I had there. I remember they were always trying to get her to move up to admin, but she didn't want to leave the classroom. Such a good teacher. Oh, she got teacher of the year last year. You know she deserves it. Put a little bit more in here. There we go. That's awesome. How about your sister? You know, I miss her. She hasn't called me in a while. No, I think she's finally uh, settling down, huh? I never thought I'd see the day. Well, you know we were. <laughs> we were kind of bad girls in high school. Running around. No, I never thought your sister would uh, settle down with one person. <laughs> but that's good. She seems really happy. Okay. Here we go. Just get in here. Okay. All ready to go. Here we go. Get my cloth ready so we can wipe off any excess. All right. Do not move, okay? You know the drill. Okay. There we go. Very nice. Speaking of relationships, how's it going with... Uh, is it Christine? Yeah. No, really? Oh, I'm so sorry. When did that happen? Yeah. Can I ask why? You know, that just happens sometimes. You grow apart. Well, it sounds like at least it was uh, pretty amicable, so that's good. But, uh, you did say, you said you're going on a date tonight, right? So, who are you going on a date with? Okay. I, now, how many times have you been out before? It's a first date. Oh my goodness. Okay. Well, we definitely want you looking extra sharp then. Where'd you meet her? Yeah, no, I know a lot of people are uh, meeting their 
significant others online these days. Do you have a picture of her? Of course you have a picture of her. Get, get out your phone. Show me. Come on. Oh, she's beautiful. She's beautiful. She's stunning. Oh my goodness. Now what's she seeing you? I'm just kidding. Okay. She's gorgeous. Is that, um, is that her dog in the picture? Yeah. What'd she do for work? Really? Oh my gosh. Okay, so you two are gonna be like a power couple, I see. Alright. So, you're taking her to my mom on a first date? Yeah. Well, it's a very nice place. She must seem very special. I'll just get a little bit more of this on here. Just a couple more places to clean up. So did you choose, or did she choose? You chose. What made you choose that restaurant? No, 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 mm -mm, mm -mm. no, honey. No. Okay. So does she know you're taking her to Lemma? Not yet. Okay. This that's good. Okay. So you cannot take your new interest to your ex-girlfriend's favorite restaurant. You can't do that. Not on a first date, okay? Now, if she had brought it up and it was her choice, that would be another story, but no, you can't do that. Well, because what if she asks you? What if she asks you? Oh, have you been here before? How did you hear about this place? Yeah, and then you have to start out with lies. All right, I'm gonna wipe down your face. You look good. Okay. Yeah, I know. No, don't you even worry. I know it's hard to uh, get a reservation for a Friday night this late, but let me help you out here. Do you like Italian? Okay, get in here. Taking your girl to your ex-girlfriend's favorite restaurant, my goodness. I swear. Hey, honey. Yes, Vinny there? Yeah, no, I can wait. That's fine. Yeah. You been to Nino's? No, you're gonna love it, okay? Yeah, you're gonna love it. Hey, Vinny, it's Veda. Hey. Yeah, no, 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 not for me. No. So I have a client in my chair right now. He's an old friend, and um, it's a long story, but he needs a... He badly needs a reservation for tonight at... Uh, what time? At 8? For 2. Do you have anything? Can you make it work for me? Yeah. Okay. Thank you, honey. Yeah. You can just put it under Veda. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He'll be there at 8. Thank you so much. Can you make it romantic? Put a couple candles on the table or something, okay? Yeah, how's your mom? Yeah, that's good. Okay. Yeah, I can put you in for next week. Yeah, I'll give you a discount. Thank you for helping me out. 2 p.m. on Wednesday? No, I'll make it work. I'll make it work for you. Okay, sweetheart. Thank you. Bye-bye. Okay, so Nino's at 8 o'clock, all right? No, it's really good. It's really good. You're going to like it. And uh, it is very hard to get a reservation, um, especially this short notice. So enjoy it, okay? Uh, the wine list is really good. Um, I like the chicken piccata. Delicious. The uh, turkey bolognese. What else do I like there? Uh, they have a really good white lasagna. Very, very good. If she doesn't like meat, white lasagna. Oh, no. Yeah, it just has the ricotta and, like, an Alfredo-type sauce. And Yeah, no red sauce. White lasagna. Uh, for dessert? 
the tiramisu. Get the tiramisu or the lady fingers, but I would go tiramisu, okay? Because the way they serve it, they come out with it in like this um this pot and they pour the cream over and oh my god. Decadent, decadent, it's delicious. You're gonna love it, okay, sweetie? Yeah, no, I got your back. Don't you worry, don't you worry. Lemon is very nice, but you just can't take her there, okay? Maybe down the line, but Nino's, Nino's will take care of you. Vinny's gonna make it real special for you, okay? I'm just going through a little bit. Okay, I'm gonna wet your hair, okay? Wet your hair a little bit. Mm. You just be lucky I'm not telling your sister about this whole thing. You would never hear the end of it. I'm trying to take your new girl to your ex-girlfriend's favorite restaurant. Not on my watch. You don't know, honey. I'll look out for you. Don't worry. Oh, I forgot to ask you when you came in. You didn't park in the uh, spots for the mattress store, did you? Okay, good. No. They never have any business, but they will have you towed. Yeah. No, they'll have you towed. And honestly, I think that they are a front. No, I don't think, I've never seen them actually sell a mattress. So I think they're, um, I'm gonna start cutting. Okay, sweetie. I think they're, doing some laundering over there. <laughs> yeah, that's why I'm not saying anything about them having my customers tell because I don't want to end up in the river. You know? Well, you know, I went in there. I wanted a new mattress. Um, mine's getting old. I want one of those nice like, memory foam ones. So I went in there last week, and I went in, and there's like two guys working, but neither of them like approached me and asked me if I needed help or anything. They just kind of stared at me from afar, just kind of stared me down while I was looking at the mattresses. Yeah. And then I asked them, just, um, if I wanted something quickly, what they had in stock. And they don't actually have any inventory, they said. I said, oh, we don't, we don't have any inventory. We order it for you. We can have it delivered. But they have a very large um, store with a very big stock room for somebody that doesn't actually carry any inventory, so I don't really know. I don't exactly trust what's going on over there, but despite not actually ever selling any mattresses and never having any customers, they will have you towed, so um, yeah, just in the future. Never park in their spots, okay? Alright. Okay, that looks really good. I'm just gonna comb through that again, and... Uh, get some of that loose hair out. We don't want you going to your date covered in hair. <laughs> Definitely not. Okay. Gosh, 
it's nice out one day. Can you hear them out there on the motorcycles? Yeah. Oh no, honey, I don't think I'm actually gonna ride this year. I'm starting to get kind of afraid that I'm gonna like wreck my motorcycle or get even in a small accident. Yeah. I don't know. I don't think that's really gonna work out. I think I'm gonna sell it. We'll see. One more time. Yeah. Oh, that looks amazing. Okay, so you're all cleaned up here. Hair looks really good. I'm just gonna put um, some texture in it for you, okay? Use some mousse. I have this whole new line. The scent is the same. Scent is the same as the shaving cream smell. Yeah. Okay. No, yeah, I sell it. If you want some, I'll give it to you at cost. You just have to uh, make sure that your sister calls me, okay? Yeah. You look so handsome. You look like a movie star. Okay. Yeah, the restaurant, um, the Alfredo is really good. She likes Alfredo. And their meatballs are really good. Everything is so authentic there. Oh, the carbonara. The carbonara. If you like a good carbonara, really authentic carbonara, so no, no cream or anything stupid like that. Real carbonara thickened with egg. Try that. It has like really good imported pancetta in it. You'll love it, I swear. Okay. But the tiramisu for dessert, definitely. That looks perfect. You look amazing. All right. So um, try not to wait three months before coming back in, okay? We'll keep it nice and cleaned up for you, but you look fabulous. All right. Let me know how the date goes, okay? Really, really good luck. She sounds fantastic and she's absolutely gorgeous. You guys are going to have a great time at Nino's. All right. Yeah. Oh, you're welcome, sweetie. So I'll see you soon, okay? Bye-bye.